At the moment, I'm working in Africa, and I work primarily in the Congo, which is a huge part of Central Africa. And the Congo River is just this enormous river system that runs through the heart of Africa. And it's really poorly known ichthyologically. I mean, people depend on the fishes of the Congo. People have been eating fishes in the Congo for millennia. But scientists haven't really had a chance to get in there and start studying the fish. So every time I go to Congo, I discover new species of fish. And it's, it's remarkable. But when you say you discover new species, obviously the local people know those fishes and they have names for those fishes, but the scientific world doesn't know those fishes and it doesn't have names for those fishes. And you also have to be a little bit of an expert or have some background to enable you to recognize that you know what I'm holding in my hand has never been described scientifically. So you have to have some background knowledge. You have to know what fishes have been described from that region, what you might expect to find there. And then you find something that doesn't fit any of the descriptions. And you think, hey, maybe this is a new species. And that's really when the work begins.